Still detecting oil in the water. That's a four mile long oil slick so far. When I analyzed it, it was clearly engine oil. Something's leaking. Maybe someone's in trouble. If they're leaking this much oil into the water and they're not in trouble, they will be when I catch them. It could be a fishing boat or a freighter. Or that! The Dark Orca! Reversing props, full stop. Whoa. Aranax to Dark Orca, are you receiving? Over. Aranax to Dark Orca, can you hear me? Hmm. That's weird. Maybe it's pirate nap time. Maybe it's abandoned. Maybe. This could be a trap. I'll take a closer look. What part of this could be a trap didn't you understand? And be careful. Huh. No one here. Looks like they left in a hurry. They even left a meal just sitting there. I wonder why. No idea. Let's take a closer look. Hello? Secure the nights. What's happening here? Out. I'll stay in the swamp night. Keep behind me. Hello? Anyone? Huh? Uh... I think it's safe. Hmm. It's like they've completely vanished. <gasps> What's going on? Huh? I have a theory. There's only one logical explanation. I'm listening. The pirates were taken by ghosts. My family are explorers. We have been for generations. While others look up to the stars, we know there are an infinite number of things that shine in the darkness below. There are things lurking in the seas that long ago vanished into myth. My family are the Nectins, and we explore the deep. Ghosts? Why do I keep expecting you to have a rational theory? I actually have a theory on that. You want to hear it? Mm, no. I don't know what you're all seeing, but that oil leak isn't slowing down. Can we go now? Before we vanish too? I'm taking a closer look at the hull. One of the ballast water vents is broken. The filter cover has a hole in it. I'm gonna patch it up to stop the leak. Good thinking, Mom. We'll keep exploring the ghost angle. No, we won't. Huh? What was that? I don't know. Hammerhead? This is Will Nectar. Nectar? What do you want? 
Have you by any chance lost your submarine? No! Are you sure? Because we found one that sure looks like your sub. No, it uh, could be a similar sub, but it's definitely not ours. Really? Same rust, same stains, and the wheel has property of Captain Hammerhead written on it? Uh, lots of people are named Hammerhead. Uh, what about this portrait, which clearly shows you and your family? Um, just out of interest, are you guys okay? Why wouldn't we be? Nothing strange happening. Where are you exactly? <laughs> Mom, this mystery just got better. Copy. I've managed to stop the leak. And there's this large intermittent echo on sonar. But it keeps disappearing. Ghosts would probably be very hard to pin down on sonar. And... I'm gonna try to get a fix on whatever this is. It might explain what's going on here. Okay. Be careful. You too. <laughs> what was that? It sounds like voices. But we've searched everywhere. There's no one on board. No one human. Fontaine? I said, no one human. I heard you. Where's your sensible ground and comeback? I don't have one. What? Dad, tell Fontaine to go back to being a cold, logical, calming influence. The noises are coming from this direction. So, we're gonna go in the opposite direction? No. We're gonna get to the bottom of it. That signal is suddenly stronger. It seems to be coming from somewhere over there. It's coming from... Fontaine. What are you doing in there? Um, we were locked in here by unknown assailants. Uh, I don't see any locks. Leave now! Where's the rest of your crew? I said, get off me sub! Was it the ghosts? <gasps> what do you know about the ghosts? Is that why you're hiding? We're, we're not hiding. Quick, hide again! What's that? The engine! Again. Oh, the ship is being controlled by other forces. <laughs> Mom, ghosts have taken the dark orca. Aunt, what did you say? We're being hijacked by ghosts. You're moving too fast. There's a rock pillar ahead of you. Point a hit. <laughs> Orca's not built to move at this speed. It's barely built to move at all. Uh, now that's just hurtful. Watch out! There are rock formations everywhere. If we don't get control of your sub, you won't have any sub left. Let me climb into the air ducts. I'll undo some wiring to stop the ship. I've sabotaged this sub before. We can't trust him! Proper sabotage needs a proper pirate. Well, if you see any proper pirates, you let me know. I'm a great pirate, and I'm going! Aye, if there's one thing Madeline's good at, it's wrecking things. Please, it could cause havoc on a scale you can barely imagine. We don't have time for this. We get it. You're both proud of the destructive capabilities of your kids. Now, stick them both in the air duct. I'm, I'm not, not getting in a confined space with her. her. <sighs> Are you happy now? We may have to work together. That doesn't mean I have to talk to you. Then why don't you stop talking? Out of it! Help me! This is the main power array. 
This is where we can do the most damage. You think this is my first sabotage? Look out! Underwater mountain dead ahead. <laughs> Back into it! Turn hammerhead! I put twice as much back into it as you! Um, are you both turning in opposite directions? <laughs> well, that's a little embarrassing! Hide the starboard! <gasps> oh, no. Ah! Danny boy, you said you'd fix that! I say a lot of things! Look out! Ah! Hold on, guys! Wait! The red one! It's always the red one! Everyone okay? They... they did it! Yes! Oh, that was amazing! The way you destroyed the life support systems? Huh, I never would have thought to be that irresponsible! Me? How about the reckless way you tore out the stabilizers? It's like you don't even care about your ship! <laughs> <laughs> we just high-fived. And complimented each other. No one can ever know about this. Agreed. Yeah! Hey, I'm embarrassed too, but running away seems a bit extreme. Huh? Ah! Ghost. I, the Dark Orca, be haunted. What? Huh? Haunted? Ah! They chased us out of the ducks. Look! Huh? Ah! Dad! They're not ghosts. They're eels. Come on, Dad. Wake up. Help me sit them up. Okay, maybe they're eels. But they might be zombie ghost eels. They're eating, Ant. I don't think ghosts eat. Oh, yeah? Now you're suddenly an expert on the underworld? I've never seen anything like them. Keiko, I think you should take a look at these things. I'm heading for the moon pool. Whoa! Will, I'm not getting in there. The moon pool door has gone haywire. Aunt, did you and Madeline do this? Sabotage isn't an exact science. What did you want me to see? Can you show them to me? Um, let me try to... Okay, look! I've seen these before, but not like this. Incredible. You've seen ghost seals before? They're not ghosts. They're babies. I've heard reports of them growing to this size. But if the babies are over a meter long... dream about wet, slippery eels and a... Huh? Oh, her lover. The larvae must have been wriggling through the sub, creating havoc with the circuits and wiring. So we weren't possessed by ghosts? No. No, I mean, of course we weren't. I did try to tell the rest of the crew it was ridiculous before they abandoned ship. But it's okay. I'll protect you from the eels, Fontaine. What? When we found you, you were literally hiding in a hole. I'm not scared of... Ah! Huh? Huh? What do we do? 
snakes. Huh? He's right. Am I missing something? Eggs. Are we even having the same conversation? The baby eels like eggs. Even these pickled ones. We can use them as a lure. We have heaps of pickled eggs in the galley. They last forever. Huh. What was that? Uh-oh. What? The moon pool door is locked open. If the super eel sees it... Can we close the doors? The eel larvae have short-circuited something. Again! Go get the eggs. Where are you going? Eggs. Huh? Eggs! Are we even having the same conversation? Hurry, Maddie! <laughs> Will! What is it, Keiko? Look out! The super eel is coming aboard! Keiko, I need you to be ready. For what? You and I are going to try to remove the eel. I know, I know, it's not going to be easy. How do we know if it's even working? Oh, oh never mind. <laughs> Dad, it's working. They're coming after the eggs. Draw them to the moon pool room. Uh, isn't the moon pool room full of giant eel? Your mother and I are working on that. Are we really going to do this? I mean... How big could it be? Okay, Danny boy. Hit it! No! off our son. Now, get off me, soap! Uh. <clears throat> oh, would you look at that? Uh, eh. 
would be heartwarming if it wasn't so gross. Daddy boy, are we ready to set sail? Aye, Captain. The oil leak fixed. I've glued the wheel back on, and Madeline has unsabotaged everything she sabotaged. Then, full speed ahead! Um, still some unsabotaging to do by the look of it, Captain. <sighs> <laughs> Having some trouble? Of course not, Dave Reaver. It's an advanced driving technique. There is a good one, Johnny Boy. But also, I wanted to make it clear that I didn't faint earlier because of the eels. I just, uh, uh I, I had low blood sugar. Uh, 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 ah! oh, there he goes again. <laughs> yeah, well, it's just a cable, Captain. Captain. I'm sure when Hammerhead finally wakes up, he'll be elated. What's wrong? Don't you find my jokes electrified? Oh. Oh.